the thing about it is, in a, real, in a world where 92% of spending happens offline, we're building really interesting audiences for 50 of the top 100 ad age advertisers, right? And so if you are the CMO of McDonald's and you want to go after people who now have shifted from McDonald's to Burger King, we can find millions of phones that fit that profile. Um, we have a, a network of other apps that also provide us information that we can interpret using these shapes that you saw. And then we'll, you know, if, if Nike wants to find 20 million US smartphones that go to the gym three times a week, we can create a segment for that and provide them advertising across thousands of apps. Um, and if Anheuser-Busch wants to talk to millennials who go to bars frequently in 20 DMAs, we can find those phones as well. And then we can measure the impact of seeing ads on, on walk-in to stores, which is one of our mm -hmm. other magic tricks. It's, that's back to the cookie for yeah. the real world. And, um, and so, so we, we build audiences, and um, we never transfer data, to be very clear. We, they come and you know, at and will buy a million dollars of advertising from us, and we'll help them find people who've recently been at a Sprint store or a Verizon store or something like that. So, um, but we also have launched attribution as an open service, so you don't have to buy advertising from us. Um, and so tons of advertisers, this is one of our fastest growing products, it's probably growing 300% this year. And that is, um, you can buy a campaign from AOL or Yahoo or wherever, and we'll tell you whether the ads are working. Whether people who saw the ad for the Subway sandwich shop are more likely to walk in compared to a control group um, after seeing the ad over the next week. Because we, we have a big enough panel, it's like a Nielsen panel of the real world, that we can do an overlap and see the impact versus similar people at an incremental level. As I always say, as a marketer, you shouldn't care how many people walk into Subway. You should care how many more walked into Subway thanks to the advertising. And so we're able to really measure that in a mathematically robust way for people. And that's powerful because the classic adage, you know, half my marketing spend is wasted. Now we're trying to eat into that. I'm sorry if that disrupts any businesses in this room. Um, but you know, it's, it's really, but even better, like we can say, hey, you know, the, the ad for, for healthy subs is working for you know, women in this demographic and these DMAs, and the ad for like, the double marinara bacon <laughs> sub or whatever it is you know, is working for these demographics and in these cases, and so we're really able to help them refine their marketing.